Hello everybody, got another video here on how to install your blades on the four and a half inch Harbor Freight wet, wet tile saw. It's pretty easy, the instructions don't really show you how to put this on, but I will kind of show you that also. You will want to pull this cover off here and on this you can keep your tools in here if you wanted which you get these here too you can just stick them in there and keep them that way you don't lose them but you also need a Phillips screwdriver to go along with that first of all you'll want to take a screw here out And after you get that out, this here door slides out in the back and it just slides on out of there and they get a chain on it so you don't lose it. But as far as installing this, this little bracket they give you will actually slide up in behind here and it'll come up through there and there's a little screw you put down through there to hold it. And this here just the bolt comes out, you screw it back in. And But on these here, there's a little nut on here, and you got a wrench here that hooks into that, and you just turn that loose. And that slides off of there. And you can actually use the four inch blades that come from Harbor Freight. It's actually a four and a half inch saw, but these hair ones will work on them. The arbor on these are five eighths. So if you buy blades elsewhere, make sure you get them with the five eighths inch arbor. And on this here, it shows you which way it actually turns. There's a little arrow. I don't know if you can see it. And you have the arrows on here. You always want to make sure you get these going the right direction. You just slide that on there. Make sure it goes over the little arbor part. Stick that back on there and... You want to hold that make sure you get it good and tight and like I said you can take and put your wrenches back in here so you don't lose them that way you always got it with the saw And this hair just slides back into that little groove right here in the plastic. And the screw goes back down in there and you tighten it up a little bit. Don't over tighten it because it will break. It's not real heavy material there. snug it up a little bit and you take your cover here raise this back up slide that into place and that's all there is to it to change the blade on your wet and tile saw from Harbor Freight and as you can see it sticks up there plenty enough to cut a tile into so the four and a half inch they say that it is you really don't need that size of blade but that all is that's all there is to it and i can't speak apparently but anyway have a good day don't forget to like comment and subscribe on my videos and take it easy and see you in the next one bye